trying to stay at the mouth, don't you? Uh, no. What? Hell, I love getting all kinds of cards. I love receiving candy. How about you? Oh, yeah. I, I like the candy, too. But I think uh, knowing that I am loved feels so good. Yeah, I like feeling loved, too. I love you, Hippo. Uh, I love you, too, Tomsky. Uh, give me a hug. Uh. Mm. Okay. Let's go make some cards for everybody. Yeah, let's make some homemade cards. Okay, let's go. Valentine's Day is by Gail Gibbons. Valentine's Day is a celebration of friendship and love. It is celebrated on February 14th. This special day grew out of old beliefs and customs. In ancient Rome, people celebrated the beginning of spring with a festival. Boys picked names of girls from an urn to find their partners for the event. Often the people they chose became their sweethearts. Doves were a symbol of love. Valentine's Day is Saint Valentine. About 1800 years ago, a kind man named Valentine was put in jail because of his religious beliefs. There are many stories about Valentine. In one, he became friends with his jail guard, who had a blind daughter. Before Valentine died, he gave the guard a message to bring to the girl. When the jail guard's daughter opened the message, she could see. The message read, from your Valentine, Valentine died on February 14th. Later, he was named a saint. What a miracle. Valentine's Day is Poems. It is believed that about 600 years ago, a French nobleman, the Duke of Orleans, was the first person to make valentines. While he was in prison, he wrote many love poems to his wife. Some poems mentioned St. Valentine, who by then had become the patron saint of love. Valentine's Day has many symbols. Valentine's Day is hearts. Red hearts have been a symbol of love since ancient times. A red heart is the most popular Valentine symbol. To give a heart is a symbol of giving the most important part of yourself. Ribbons. The Middle Ages were from about 450 to 1450. Often ribbons are used to decorate valentines. The symbols of ribbons come from the Middle Ages. When knights competed in tournaments, their sweethearts often gave them ribbons for good luck. And lace. Lace is often used to decorate valentines too. The word lace comes from the Latin word laques. This means to snare or net, as in catching someone's heart. Valentine's Day is Cupid. Cupid was the god of love in ancient Rome. People thought that when Cupid shot one of his special arrows into someone's heart, the person fell in love. This is why he is a symbol of love. Valentine's Day is Valentine cards. Some people save old Valentines. On Valentine's Day, everyone likes receiving Valentine cards. There are many different kinds. Some are fancy and have love poems or sayings in them. Other Valentine cards make you laugh. They can be silly. Some Valentine's cards pop up when you open them. Others have moving parts. Still, others actually have voices that say, Be my Valentine, when the cards are opened. 
Many people like to make their own valentines. If the card is not signed, it may keep a sweetheart guessing. Who sent the secret valentine? Lots of people buy their valentine's cards. There are so many different kinds to choose from. Valentine's Day is giving valentines, too. People give valentines to friends and loved ones. Some people even give valentines to their pets. Valentine cards may be sent far away. Valentine's Day is flowers and candy. People give flowers to the people they care about. The red rose is the flower of love. Some people give candy because it is sweet to a sweetheart. There are heart-shaped boxes full of chocolates. Other candies are heart-shaped and have messages on them. Valentine's Day is Valentine decorations. There are red and pink hearts. Cupids, lace, ribbons, and hearts are some of the things that remind us of Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is Valentine parties, treats, and games. People get together and have a good time. There are lots of goodies to eat. At school, classmates give each other Valentine's cards. Some classmates may decorate a box. All the Valentines are put in the box. Then the cards are taken out and distributed. Maybe this idea came from the time when the Romans picked names out of the urn. Everyone gets lots of cards. Valentine's Day is a day of giving and saying, I, I love, love you. you. How to make a valentine. You need crayons and markers, paper, stickers, scissors, glue, glitter, ribbon, cupids, paper, lace, doilies, and photos. Fold a piece of paper in half. Draw half of a heart shape starting at the fold. Cut along the line. Open the fold and paper. Both halves of the heart will be equal. Decorate the heart any way you want. Write a special message on your valentine. Lord, help us to remember that love is patient, love is kind. It does not boast, it is not proud, it is not envious or self-seeking, it is not angry, but forgiving. Love does not lie, but rejoices in truth. It always protects. It always trusts. It always hopes. It always tries. Love never fails. From 1 Corinthians 13. <laughs>